Welcome to Wicklow GA Coaching and Games Development Online Primary School Activities. My name is Noel Morris and I'm presenting activities for first and second class along with Jackie Kinch. This is session number four. Right, let's go and have some fun. Today we're going to do a lot of hurling and the equipment we need then is a hurl. If you haven't got a hurl, a wooden spoon or a big spoon like I have here. You also need a tennis ball, three pairs of socks, a basket like so, or a bigger one if you have it, or a box. And most important, what? Yeah. We get straight and into the warm up then. I do a demonstration on each warm up, and then uh, you can do 30, 20 seconds of it then, okay? So the first one then is jogging the spot. I'm going to do a demonstration. Okay. So, can everyone go and do that then for 20 seconds, please? Okay, everyone on first second class, start. Now get those knees up. Keep going. Six seconds left. Three, two, one. Well done. Okay, the next exercise we're going to do then, we're going to do a demonstration, is the heels up to the bone. So you put your arms, your hands, behind your back, and try to get your heels to go down. Okay, let's can everyone do that then for 20 seconds? Okay, time starts now. Move around a bit on that if you want. Well done, 10 seconds left. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Excellent. Okay, the next one then is I want you to bounce on your left leg for 4, bounce on your right leg for 4, left leg. Okay, that's the demonstration for 20 seconds to start now. Go first and second pass. Left leg, right leg. Well done. Ten seconds left. Five, four, three, two. One, super, well done. Okay, the next three or four exercises we're going to do then is animal movements, okay? So we're going to do the crab crawl first, like I'm going to show you a demonstration of the crab crawl. Okay, so you go like that, okay? And you go backwards, forwards, you can go sideways, and the other way, okay? Backwards, forwards, sideways, left and right. Okay, let's go and do that for 20 seconds, the crab crawl. Go. One down. Ten seconds left. Keep going. If you fall over, it's any bit of fun. Well done. Keep trying. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Next animal movement then is the duck walk. Be down like so. Bend your knees out. Put two elbows inside your knees. Okay. We walk like so. Okay? Walk like a duck. You can make the noises if you want. Okay? Two elbows inside the knees. Just walk around like a duck. Okay? 20 seconds starts now. Well done. Keep going. 10 seconds left. Walk like a duck. Five. Four, three, two, one. Excellent. Okay, the next one then is the frog jump. Okay, so same again. Two elbows out, knees out. Okay, hands on the ground. And jump up as far as you can. Okay, that's the demo. I'll get you to go now for 20 seconds. Jump as high as you can. Well done. 10 seconds left, down again, keep going, 4, 2, 0, excellent, well done, 
The last time we'll move then is the giraffe walk. Okay, so you're gonna close like so and up to the ears. Point your fingers up as high as you can and walk around on your tippy toes. Okay, that's the giraffe walk. Okay, anywhere you want to go on your tippy toes, arms and close to the ears. Okay, go for 20 seconds. Well done, first and second class. Stay on your tippy toes. Five seconds left. Two and zero. Excellent. Well done. Everyone deserves a drink of water now. So this is a water break. Okay. Take your time. Hold on. Why are we getting a drink of water then? You can have a look at me. I'm going to just demonstrate on how we hold a hurl. Okay. So my dominant hand is my right hand. Okay, so I hold the hurl in my right hand. I hold the thumb down here, okay, and close to the boss. See where the toe is? Toe is pointing away from you, okay? That's the way we hold it if you're right handed. Shows you the hand you're right with is your dominant hand, okay? Then if you're left handed, you hold it with the left hand, okay? Thumb down here near the boss and point your toe away, okay? So get it back into your dominant hand then, and I'm just going to show you a demonstration of what we're going to do next. So we use one of the pair of socks. We take four, put, put the socks on the hurl, we take four steps, two, three, four, take it off our hand, put it back down, one, two, three, four, we do that job and we're running, okay? Whichever direction you want, four steps, and then take it off the hurl, okay, with your hand, okay? Let's do that then for 30 seconds, okay? Time starts now. Four steps, take it off the hurl, four steps. Excellent, well done. 10 seconds left, keep going. Time up, well done. Okay, the next one then is, we're going to flick the sock, look, flick the sock up, and grab it with your hand like a hawk. See that, look, that's like a hawk. Grab it right quick, okay? So flick it up, and grab it, okay? So I'm gonna do a demonstration on this one, okay? So we run around, four steps, flick it up, catch it like a hawk. Okay, 30 seconds starts now. Let's see how many of them we can get in. That's it. Well done. And if you've no hurl again, you can be using a wooden spoon or a big spoon, okay? 10 seconds left. Three, two, one. Excellent. Okay. Now the next one then is look, get th three pairs of socks. Look, one, two, three. Put them on the ground, anywhere you want. Right? So I'm just going to show you the demonstration now. So you run around, you pick up any socks you want in any direction. So you pick up the socks, you put it on your herd, throw it anywhere you want, pick up the next one. Okay? Any direction you want. Now, we're going to do that for 30 seconds. He's ready. Time starts now. Go. Well done. Keep your eye on the socks on the bird. Well done. 10 seconds left. Super stuff. Three, two, one. Excellent, well done for second class. Well done boys and girls. Now, we're gonna have one minute flick the socks challenge into the basket, okay? So this is the basket I have here. So you come back to where you're gonna start. Take two big steps out, one, two, down your basket. Get your three socks, and I'm just gonna show you a demonstration here now. So I have my socks ready. Socks up to her, I'm trying to flick it into the basket. One, two, count your score. Three, okay, you run up, get him again. 
four. And if you miss it, you must go again and bring it back. That's a one minute challenge. Count your score and let your teacher know how many you got. Are you ready? One minute starts now. exercise we're going to do with the hurl is the hand-eye coordination. Again, I'm going to use a tennis ball. If you don't have a tennis ball, you can use a pair of socks. Okay? So I have the hurl in my dominant hand. I'm holding here in the ready position. I'm going to come over beside my wall. I'm going to show you a demonstration now what I'm looking for. Okay? I want you to throw it off the wall. Okay? And try and catch it around your waist there. We'll do that for 30 seconds and see how many we can get. See the way I'm in the ready position? That was in a match, I'd get ready to strike. Okay? Eyes on the ball. Okay, we've got enough 30 seconds. Are you ready? Time starts now. Let's see if you can beat the coach. Catch it around the waist. Six. Keep going, keep going. Five seconds left. Try again, another one in. Well done. And stop. Excellent. So remember your score you got that time. We're going to go again now for 30 seconds. Okay? So if you got eight or nine that time, let's try to get 10. Okay? So if we've no socks, or if no ball, we use the socks, okay? Best we can. Are you ready? Time starts now, 30 seconds. Eyes on the ball at all times. You can move it if you want on your toes. It makes it a little bit harder. Okay. 10 seconds left. Come on, boys and girls, you can do this well done. Super stuff. Okay, well done, freeze. Time up. Now, for the next one then, what we're going to do is, we're going to throw the ball a little bit higher, and we're going to try and catch it just above the chest, okay? We're going to do that for 20 seconds. This time, just 20 on this one, all right? Are you ready? Go, 20 seconds. 15 seconds. Five. Excellent. 
Super stuff. Time up. Okay, we're going to do that once more, but this time we're going to just make it progress it a little bit. What we're going to do is we're going to be jogging on the spot. So we're just trying to move a little bit. So we're moving in and out to the ball if we can, all right? So I'm just going to show you a demonstration on this. You ready? That's the demonstration. Okay, if you can, we're going to try and catch it around the chest. Okay, ready? Time starts now. 20 seconds. That's a little bit hard. Keep going. 10 seconds left. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Well done, everyone. Little breather there now. With one more exercise to go. If you need to get a drink of water, get a drink of water. Okay. So to demonstrate the last one then is we're going to try and catch the ball above her head. The horse still says in her dominant hand, I'm right handed, so hold it like so. Your left hand, change it over, okay? So what we do then is we throw the ball and it's up above her head. Okay, let's see, it's going to be very hard to get pinned, but we're going to try. Okay, got to go above her head. Again, the hurdle is in the ready position in case I'm ready to strike it in a match. Okay, we're going to do that for 20 seconds. That's a tough one as well. Are you ready? Let's go and have some fun at it now. Time starts now. You can stay in the standing position for the first one. Make sure it goes above your head. Two. Well done. Five seconds left. Two. One. Excellent. Okay, the last one then for today. The on the hurdle side of it. He's ready? So it's the same again. I'm going to do just a quick demonstration. So we're going to throw it above her head. Try and catch it. This time we're going to try and move her toes a little on her toes if we can. Okay, so we're ready in a match. The hurdle is in the ready position as well. Okay, so make sure it goes well above your head. If you have to jump, jump. Try and get maybe two or three of them if we can. Are we ready? Time starts now. 20 seconds. Well done. Seven seconds left. Well done, first second class, super stuff. Two, one, excellent. Okay. Now we're gonna put these down now. That was super stuff today. And we're just gonna do a small bit of a warm now. Okay, so it's gonna cool now. Excellent stuff today, well done, super. So then what I want you to do then is arms. Cross your body like so, right arm across, your upper left arm, try and get your left arm up behind your head. Just stretch out your muscles up now. Well done. Okay, do two more of them on the right arm. Excellent. One more. Right, now we're going to do the left arm. Cross the body, open the right hand, try and get your hand in at the back, your right hand at the back of your head. Hold it for two or three seconds. That's one. Next one then, that's two on the left. And one more, three on the left. Okay, next one then is just, you want to just put your toes, like so, and then come back up onto your tippy toes. Okay, you can see, come on your tippy toes. So touch your toes, and back up onto your tippy toes. We're going to do three of them. Are you ready? Touch your toes. Back up onto your tippy toes. Excellent. That's one. Touch your toes. Back up onto your tippy toes. Try to hold it there for two seconds. Two. Three. Excellent. That was super stuff today. Next week, the session five will be with Jackie Kinch. And I'll see you all then for session six. Thank you very much. See you then. Bye bye.